Oh, hi. I'm Paul Daniel, regulatory compliance expert at Visalo. We put a lot of effort into making ViewLink 5 intuitive to set up and easy to use. One technique we used to achieve this was the drag and drop. Because of the drag and drop, it makes the user physically connect two items, it forms a strong association in the brain. And this in turn makes us more likely to remember how to do a task. I'd like to share three cool ways that we've used the drag and drop in ViewLink 5. When we first set up ViewLink 5, we need to connect the incoming data recorded by a physical sensor to a virtual location. Even though this sensor might get replaced over the years, the data will always be connected to the same virtual location. So on screen, I want this sensor, here named Sensor 1, to report its data to a location named Freezer 1. To connect them, we simply grab our sensor and drag it over and drop it on our location, just like that. You may not know it, but that task, connecting sensors to locations, is typically one of the hardest tasks when setting up a monitoring system. By using the familiar drag and drop process, we made setup really easy in ViewLink 5. I'd like to show you another way we use drag and drop. One of the easiest and clearest ways to view live data is to see it on a dashboard. This is a screen where your data can be overlaid on a map of your facility. How do we get the data onto the map? That's where the drag and drop comes in. Simply grab Freezer 1 and drag it to its location on the map. Click Save. Drag and drop makes it easy and intuitive. We also put this technique to use for trend analysis. Let's say we want to collect uh, to look at historical data that we've collected from Freezer 1. All we have to do is shift to the trend window, boom, grab Freezer 1, and drag it on over. Making a trend graph has never been easier. We can easily save this report right here on the same page, just like that. Drag and drop is just one of the techniques we've used in ViewLink 5 to make it intuitive, easy to learn, and simple to use. Each of the drag and drop tasks I shared with you, they can all be performed uh, and learned by taking an interactive tour, which teaches you by guiding you through the task. Just open the Tours menu in the upper right-hand corner to get started. We weren't joking when we call ViewLink 5 a system that virtually deploys itself. If you like this video and want more ViewLink tips, you can click the link here to see our other videos. If you want to get more contact with Vaisala, you can interact with us on our ViewLink blog. You can also sign up for our newsletter and we'll notify you when we have a live ViewLink training session near you. Thanks for stopping by.